Hi, this is Ilma Art Studio and here I am sharing with you there's a little glare on there a church that a church that I took a picture of and this is in San Agustin Church in the Philippines so you will see how intricate the architecture is and the in in the indoor um, lines and shapes and everything check my website at www.ilmaarts.com and today I'd like to share with you my poem devotional which is extracted from Psalm 97 verse 11 which says light shines on the godly and joy on those whose hearts are right and here is the poem that I wrote regarding that uh, verse hearts that are right those whose hearts are right always have God's insight. Those whose hearts love to please the Lord, it seeks God and bring Him applaud. Whenever your hearts stay pure, you will be protected from the devil's lure. Light shines on the godly. They always enjoy life fully. And that is the end of the poem and here is the essay part of the devotional. Our physical heart's condition is crucial for living a physically healthy life. The heart's spiritual health, which is our attitudes, is just as important as our physical health. What does it mean to have a, health, a healthy heart spiritually? It means that our hearts seek and long for God's will and ensures that it is aligned to His. A heart that is right is free from corruption of the world's standards. It is a heart that doesn't cater to the pleasures of the self, but it is bent on following God's will. It is a heart free from selfishness, envy, and pride, but full of love, humility, and selflessness. The Bible tells us that right, the light shines on the godly, and joy on those whose hearts are pure, are right. Those who follow God's commands and serve Him are given light and discernment. As a result of their choice to be godly, they have peace and joy. Lord, help me to keep my heart pure for You. Reflection. Why is your heart's condition essential in your spiritual growth? And that's the end of the essay part of the devotional and here's some testimony about um, Psalm 97. I could um, assure you that uh, when your hearts are pure and right and that you're godly, God always protects you and takes care of you and he does. Like It, it doesn't exempt us from having a good, uh, from it doesn't exempt us from problems and troubles and trials and hardship but it it makes us uh, do the right thing because we're always uh, given a choice to do wrong or evil. But uh, when your hearts are aligned with God and are pure and are not corrupt, not envious, not selfish, then it's easy for you to choose the right thing. And then as a result of that, you have God's insight. You, you view the world like God would view it. And then you... You're joyful, and uh, no, no matter how how much uh, hardship you you get in your life, or how much trials you undergo, there is always that joy inside you. It's not it's not uh, worldly joy, but it's a joy that comes from the knowledge that you are following God. And with that, we end this poem devotional. Thanks for watching, and I hope that you will check my website at ilmaarts.com. That's I-L-M-A-A-R-T-S.com. Thanks for watching.